social services play a huge role uh, in improving lives. In fact, in 2013, the Institute of Medicine released a report. Uh, it was shorter lives, poorer health. And they compared our country to other industrialized nations who actually spent more on social services, less on health care, yet got better health outcomes. So I think we're discovering now the fact that social services play indeed as important, if not more important, in improving things like life expectancy and quality of life. What we know is that, that there are certain things that you can do in the health care system. We can fix things that are broken in the health care system. But a lot, of the, a lot of what causes the damage that needs to be fixed happens outside the health care system. People come into the health care facility when they're sick, broken down, or injured, but they have to spend 365 days a year out in their communities. And so it's those things that we do policy-wise, structural-wise, environmental-wise, um, that are really going to help to reinforce um, people being healthy in their communities, where, which is what we all want. What we're seeing with the inclusion and the hopeful inclusion of these other determinants of health is moving beyond that and creating this community of health and that that requires the information about other factors that affect health status as well as the lives of the people that we serve. If you really want to improve health, not just improve the delivery of health care, we have to look far upstream, looking at the social determinants of health, looking at poverty, transportation, safe housing, all of those things that we don't think of traditionally as healthcare delivery. And in doing so, we're finding that we actually have a lot of the data that can help us address the social determinants. What does their environment look like? Do they have opportunities for healthier food? Do they have opportunities for outdoor exercise? Do they have any of the social services that are gonna help them keep the lights on so that they don't have to think about the lights versus paying for the medicine. So um, the, the department is really, really engaged in a lot of robust activities to make sure that the data is out there so that intelligent people across the nation can really take advantage of it and fold it into something that's going to be alternatively useful from the original reason that it was collected and curated. We're looking to other domains for what might be really critical tools or standards or practices um, that can help us get where we want to go to bring the social determinants and the clinical or medical or behavioral determinants of health all together. In the context of understanding the importance of social determinants of health, we understand that both um, it's necessary for human service programs to be better, better integrated so as to bend the cost curve on the health side. And it's also really important for the clients that we serve in human services to benefit from access to care um, that's available through health reform. So understanding both directions of that interaction um, and working with our partners at the state and tribal and local level to facilitate those connections is really important. The cause for us is how do we create a uh, community that really promotes and achieves wellness for all, uh, where we people have the health, uh, the safety, uh, and the economic well-being uh, for San Diegans. And that cultural shift inside institutions and across the community uh, is really our greatest challenge.